eight because my rooms had a change. So originally there was only one shelving unit in this room, which I had to squeeze every single freaking model in the whole house onto. Now, as you said, I am descaling down to more high quality models now, not plastic cheap tacky foundings called some Colgate models are rubbish, so they're not in the they're not the thing. But models like the Escape Bladder and the Dennis castings, they're going going in the collection. All local fire brigades, that's something that's on the agenda to keep collecting more Merseyside, Cheshire, Lancashire stuff. Just because I'm a local lad, I like my local fire engines. But some tacky cheap stuff will be going. Unfortunately, I am down down. It's the same with Star Piranha models, they'll be going as well, if they're not just quality scratch. So that stain, of course, because it's a van based fire engine and it's quite cool. I quite like it. All these stain because these are all on my shelf. As I said before, these are all staying, they're just on the shelf and yet. All these are staying. Matchbox ones will be staying, but the rest of them will be all going. So these on the shelf will be staying. Anything on the shelf is staying in the collection. Apart from some stuff in the drawer unit will be staying in the collection as well. I've forgotten to interrupt that. So some of the stuff in the drawer unit will be staying. Some stuff not in some stuff in the drawer unit will be going, but all stuff shelf will be staying intact. Um, so like I like Port Patrol. But I want to keep one Paw Patrol fire engine and one Paw Patrol fire engine from the movie just because I can. Um, but yeah, different areas. So when you look here, so that's something new's arrived today, guys. Something in high quality. All right, and that's hype. This is my another dark brown model that I've been wanting, and I didn't have the chance to get it, so I got it. That's broken, so I'm running a new one. This is the new rival today, guys. Look at that. No cheap tacky tacky there. It's a gimmick. Some more my playing bill and Lancashire trucks in there. This is the weird thing. We have a wardrobe here now. A wardrobe. And this will be a desk here. Yeah. So the plan is collecting Farringer models first. Then I'm going to be going to collecting ornaments and stuff just for the room. But first, models are important. Best. Stuff in here will be staying. Like this beautiful suku. I won't collect many of these sukus because they're just it's a one collection. Not really a massive fan of the ones anymore, just because they look bad. But I do have seen an American origin that I quite like. Stuff in here. These will be staying. That will be staying it's sweet. I don't know about that. Some of the stuff in here will be going. Definitely this this has got a broken the problem with Barago, Barago, is that how you pronounce it? The quality is crap, but they make some really decent quality. Quality models, but the 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 fin and the tw that tilts it around is broke now. But you know, I don't play with them, so it doesn't affect me as much. But if you're a collector, it's so full CD. Sorry. Oh, that's all for going. Okay, some more stuff in it that we go in, hopefully. That's not going, of course, because that's a lovely model. Some stuff in here will be going. Most of everything in here will be going, if I, if I get my own way. So these will be staying. Of course, that will be staying. But this, there's a gerbil. Look! North of nine of extra content here, we've got a gerbil. A gerbil. <laughs> Hello, Shirt Pinky. You're famous, sweetheart. This is a gerbils. That's Builder Bear. This is the new part of the room. Another shelving unit. And this is a very cool thing because most of the stuff from the desk, so the fire engine, stations and everything, move from the desk onto here. So, as you know, ambulances are no go in my collection anymore. you doing so no go but instead of making it to a fire station as well got my water rescue unit there i have to um got these beautiful now richmond richmond toys made, made some rubbish for all wars but unfortunately because i really like a highly detailed casting i really got this one to replace 
that tacky one because it's, it's an official UK fire engine. That's just a generic life flay. Unfortunately, these are generic life flays, but Corgi made the best Volvo ever. Now, come update, we've got all London Fire Brigade stuff. Um, I've gone off collecting National Fire Service stuff because I've just realised how drain it is and how much how much wasted money I've spent. I could have saved the money and bought some high quality castings, just like I should have done years ago. Pinky is doing something weird. Pinky, I'm trying to do a video, sweetheart. Never mind. So down here, well up here is all my favourite models. So we've got this beautiful Dow Parada model. This beautiful Dow Parada uh, or Colgi model. Um, this is my favourite truck. It's a rare Bowley truck. Got some Herpa and Wiking. Beautiful. Got some vans. Rope rescue van I call that. Uh, that's a workshop van. It's Tickle Tago. Obviously I have to have a recovery truck in your collection, don't you? Got another Colgi truck that I just like because it's a pound and it's one of my best finds of the year. Got some tiny Nike stuff. I absolutely recommend you get this. These castings. Two pairs of my favourite Dow Parada models. More Dow Parada favourites. And if you get to the back, we've got two Dennis's from Tiny. All my area rescue pumps. Well, not all. Most of them are on there. Um, tiny Nike Scanias and Hydraulic Platform and TL Ladders. Command units and more Dow Parada models to finish off the fleet. This this is like all my best stuff from Dow Parada. Now Dow Parada, I could collect the whole range if I wanted to do, but there's so much garbage in that collection that they should have wasted time. I mean, the fire engine tank, they shouldn't have done that. Some of the robots shouldn't have done that. There was If it was around the world, then they would have done more British stuff, but they didn't. And that's what really pisses me off with model companies, he says. They're so anti-British, it's really pissing me off. But anyway, look at my more stuff here. Or my hazmat unit and my water browser tanker. I would just say water browser or water tanker. That's my dive unit. And there's my hazmat command again. Um, I just like it, so it's staying on the collection. Fire investigation, and that's a Nottinghamshire fire car and my multi star and that canteen unit are all staying as well this is where there's going to be a big change this is the kind of stuff you'll be seeing probably more often in the collection these are from like fire museums and stuff like that i am sorting it out with books yeah and my fire helps up here now as well but like i said big change to queen to north is it and this is all changed as well my lamp and everything's on here so, good good stuff to come. More stuff to get. Um, just get get the stuff out there and produce it and get it put up for sale. Everything. Oh, this is a heartbeat fire engine. Um, heartbeat. I just put it there because I didn't want to put it because I didn't know where to put it because I didn't. Also, this has not changed. Everything's still the same now. But better finish if I can move this. I still start the room up, guys. I'm sorry about this. Right. If I get closer, well, I can't really get closer. But I can get, I can get to clean it better now than before. It was very tight, squeezed. So I could just get a brush now and clean and better. I could have had it better on this level, but you know, my brother and mum did it, so I didn't do any of this, which I'm really. Kind of not happy about, but you know, what happens when you go out on a day out and then come back, your room's all changed over. Uh, that's not a fire engine, but it's my favourite model. So, like I said, I recommend Tiny because look at this. What can you notice on every single Tiny Dykes fire engine in the window? The fire helmets. But they didn't do it in these ones, which is really weird and silly. But anyway, I mean, that, that, that blends, that chrome effect just blends off your model. That just blends off. It just blends off the fire engine. I've got some more stuff up here, look. At the minute, it's just my collection sticking to modern stuff. Mostly modern stuff. I wear some older stuff. Just, just to keep the collection going a bit more better. I mean, Colgi made some good stuff but 
also made some daft, unrealistic, unlike, like, daft stuff. Um, the only reason why keeping the unlicensed Volvo castings by Cottonwood Geese because they originally was going to be having the London's Burnie contract. So, being him, oh, uh, my tea. So, when you have coconut milk in your tea, you don't, you don't go very strong. Because coconut milk, if you put too much in, it makes your tea go cold. So, all these are amazing. And all these are amazing. My collection's getting very cool. That's also need to be sorted out. That needs to be sorted out. Oh, there's my fire stations up there as well. Look at that up there. It's just a work in progress collection at the minute. If you want to know, it's a working in progress collection at the minute, and I really am getting in there. Oh, postcard as well. Lancashire County Fire Brigade. But I've decided not to collect too much collectible stuff with non models yet until I've ticked off my collection. Because after this, guys, I might. Slow collecting because um, I'm getting to the point where now I'm getting some cool stuff. I mean, this is a really cool model. I mean, I'll, sh I'll give you a sneak peek. It's a Renault uh, Gimex. I don't know how you say it. Gimex. Um, crew cab Renault fire engine. I by Eligo, I don't think the name on the truck, I don't know, but it's an Eligo, and it's an absolute beast of a fire engine, and that, that prime model, which I've been wanting for years, is a Magna Rurus 30 meter turned from 1975, look at that, and also, low light bars on the truck itself, they're all on the ladder, you see, Dow Prada made some good stuff like that, and that. That has no place to go on the shelf. It's run out of space, so it's sitting with the cars at the minute. And also, this is no space to go, so it's just sitting on the... waiting to go in the collection. This is basically a processing yard. So, I'll tell you what this is now. This is a new thing I'm going to do. Every time I do a video, everything that comes from the video will be sat here for... A, God knows how long, and then I'd be sorting where to process it. So it may be unboxed and put into storage in the drawers once they're all empty or full of junk, and then they may get jingled into the shelving unit or that shelving unit to get replaced by something that doesn't need to be in the shelving unit anymore. So it'll probably be this, re this replaced, so it might be moved off, moved on away. It may just be jingled around. But the best Colgan model, I think, so far in my collection is everything. But also my favourite is the Volvo FM Instant Response Unit. Now, I know there's a foam salvage unit, but that's a bit boring for me. I have... I'm not quite a fan of it. I think I think if you if you Google either way, folks, it's not my kind of thing. It doesn't look like the real thing in the picture. So, yeah, I don't know. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Guys, for watching.